referred this time to you, so we'll give you uh, two more minutes. Um, I'm here on behalf of, uh, among other property owners of Levy County, I'd like to introduce uh, Chief Dave Knowles. He's the uh, Levy County Director of uh, Public Safety. And uh, my questions really are more toward the uh, public safety uh, side of things. And what I, I have a couple of questions. The first one is, um, will the, um, the trees that are cut down along the route be burned uh, out on the site? Is that likely and, uh, for this project? Well, I mean, it all depends on county regulations or local regulations. We do offer that as, as an option, but again, it has to be worked with the county, whatever the right. driving regulations are at that time. So you apply for burning permits? It, like the it, typical it, method, it, method of burning the trees? There's right? burning or chipping. Okay. Um, with respect to odor, will the gas that goes throughout Gilchrist and Levy County be odorized? I do not believe that. It will not be odorized. So if there is a gas leak, you won't be able to smell it. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. We do not typically odorize transmission pipelines. Okay. You see that in board distribution and stuff like that so that gas can be detected. Will there be any stations? Will, will you have any above ground appurtenances where the odor is added, for example, at an intersection with the distribution line or on a lateral? We're strictly transmission. We're not distribution, so we will, we will not have any distribution. Will there be any points of contact with your line where that gas is odorized in either Gilchrist or Lady County? There will not be. When will we be able to determine whether or not there's going to be any above ground appurtenances? such as meter stations, regulator stations, valves, blow-off valves, things of that nature. We're in the design, design phase right now of those main line valves. Okay. And you said before that the main pipeline wouldn't come out of the ground, but certainly other pipes will come out of the ground. And a main line valve setting. <coughs> I was specifically talking about a main line valve setting about the pipe coming out of the ground. A compressor station with meter stations, the pipeline will come out of the ground. What about uh, pig launchers? Do you have any pig launchers contemplated for Levy and Gilchrist County? Uh, no. Any block tape launchers? It's, it's what we use to, to put in line inspection tools into the system. So you put them inside there and you close the crap on the crap. The, 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 the slang term for an inline inspection tool is called tape. Yeah, it's it's more yeah, 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 I'm just talking about um, Well, it, so what you're okay. saying is that there's not going to be any tape launchers. You don't want to do it. I don't know if it's a tape launcher. Line, you, you, just, you don't have any in the county, so you're going to be able. The whole line is going to be pickable without without a launcher in Gilchrist and Levy County. Yep. Okay. Uh, has a class location been established? <coughs> okay. So when the commissioner asked you, um, is there a setback? And the answer was, well, we had a we handled in design and we handled in class location. If you have a class one location. You can have a house right next to the pipe. That's all class one. It's all based on the 660 foot corridor. This right. is the center line of your pipe and how many houses fall within a sliding mile. Okay. And that determines your class one, your class two, your class three, up to class four. So if in that sliding mile five houses are located five feet off the pipeline, you're not going to change that class. So they're not afforded to go. You'll follow DOT regulations and therefore won't change that pipe, right? Okay. Uh, what is the timetable for applying? First of all, do you anticipate having any um, open cutting of county roads? We are not planning to be open county roads. Okay. I mean, we, we, that's just, you know, we don't like to shut down roads. Okay. Down that's good. I'm sure, sure you all agree to that. When do you anticipate applying to the county for crossing the road? That's a thousand feet. Well, won't you have to know the final alignment? What is the timetable of that one? <coughs> the work certificate should come sometime at the end of 2015 or early 2016, so it would be after that, I'm guessing, right? As far as applying for the final permit, so we've already had our um, early agents talking with the various counties mm -hmm. and local You don't anticipate applying until after the first fifth gets issued, or at least the route's been approved in the EIS? Right. Okay. Yeah. 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 Ye
Okay. 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 Okay